A state police fire marshal is investigating after a local market caught fire overnight. KDK's Erica Stanish reports the initial call to 911 wasn't for a fire. She's live in Fayette County with more. Erica? Yeah, state police tell me the call initially came in as a burglary before flames broke out, and they tell me that this isn't the first time it's been broken into. The smell of smoke still lingering outside Grindle's Market in Vanderbilt after flames broke out overnight, nearly gutting everything inside. But state police say initial calls coming in weren't for a fire. Originally came in as a burger alarm, small of a car reporting someone was inside and let the store on fire. We were dispatched by a 911 call for a burglary alarm at the Grindles Market in Vanderbilt. At that time, uh, the owner was able to view on her camera footage on her phone that the market was on fire at that time. State police say this isn't the first time they've been called to the market for a break in. Last week, somebody did break in and uh, uh, I guess they got some cash out of the register, but they, I don't know if they did any other damage. The owners of the market were too upset to go on camera, but tell KDKA they've been there for four years, running what's become what some refer to as their hometown market. It saves a lot of gas running the Connellsville for stores. I mean, you always could buy a gallon of milk or something, you know, that you don't need a grocery order. They're, uh, Pepperoni rolls were fantastic. As of Friday afternoon, crews were working to board up what's left while state police conduct their investigation to learn where and how the fire started. A spokesperson says it's unclear if the burglaries and this fire are related. Oh, it was devastating. I mean, uh, unimaginable that people would do something like that. Now you can see the damage here on the outside appears to be minimal, but we're told the inside will likely need to be gutted. I talked to the owners. They say they're waiting to hear back from their insurance before they decide how to move forward. Reporting live in Vanderbilt, Erica Stanish, KDKA TV News.